The 4th of July is right around the corner guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how I made these DIY fireworks or firecrackers using Dollar Tree items. To get started, you're going to need a red and blue pool noodle from the Dollar Tree and I'm going to be cutting these down to size in three different lengths so that they're staggered and then one of the red noodles I'm going to use and paint it white. And then here are the rest of the items that you're going to use from Dollar Tree. Not sure if I'm going to use all of the items, but I just wanted to show you what I do have on hand. The only items not from Dollar Tree are these three different ribbons that I have and I did get these from Joanne Fabrics. So for the blue firework I am going to be using this red thicker ribbon from Joanne and I'm going to be putting it on vertically so the lines are going to be going up and down and then I'm going to have three ribbons on this and I'll just tuck it in the top to make sure that it's going to fit properly and then I'll just hot glue the sides and be sure to use your hot glue gun on a low setting because it doesn't need that much and it could easily melt the styrofoam. And this is what it looks like after I've hot glued all three of the ribbons. And after the white one was painted, I just am using a navy star ribbon in a horizontal pattern. And for the red one, I'm using this white star ribbon and I'm hot gluing this in like a diagonal twist formation. And for the firework on the top, I'm going to be taking apart these balloon holders from the Dollar Tree and I'm just going to disassemble it, take off the base with my wire cutters, and then just also use the wire cutters to clip off the little star pieces on the bottom. And then I forgot to add that I do take my wire cutters and trim off this top piece underneath all the frills. So once I have these kind of apart, here's the top part, and then I have the little star pieces. I am just going to be taking each piece and I'm just going to kind of stick it into the noodle and it'll kind of stay um, into the styrofoam but just make sure it doesn't poke through on some of the sides and then if you need to hot glue it on the top to keep it secure you can do that too and then I'm just going to do that with the little stars as well. So this is how the first one turned out, not too shabby. And then with the second one, um, I already put the firework frilly thing on it and I'm just going to be taking the little star pieces and sticking it into the styrofoam. And this was a lot easier doing it this way. Um, with the blue one, I had that fabric on the top and it was really hard to get that in there so this makes it a lot easier without having that on the top. And then here's how the last one turned out. Here is a final look on how the three fireworks turned out. I'm really happy how they came together. And if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see more future videos.